The Aeneid is an epic poem by the Roman poet Virgil, written between 29 and 19 BC. The poem tells the story of Aeneas, a Trojan prince who escapes the fall of Troy and journeys to Italy to establish a new homeland for his people. The Aeneid is considered one of the greatest works of Latin literature and has had a significant impact on Western literature and culture. The poem is divided into 12 books, each of which explores different themes and events in Aeneas' journey. In the first book, Aeneas and his fellow Trojans are shipwrecked on the coast of North Africa, where they meet Dido, the queen of Carthage. Dido and Aeneas fall in love, but their relationship is cut short when Aeneas receives a divine message urging him to continue his journey to Italy. In the second book, Aeneas tells the story of the fall of Troy, including the famous scene of the Trojan horse. Aeneas witnesses the death of many of his comrades, including his close friend and cousin, Hector, and the brutal treatment of his people at the hands of the Greeks. In the third book, Aeneas and his crew arrive in Sicily and participate in a series of athletic and religious games. Aeneas uses this opportunity to tell his companions the story of the founding of Troy and his own family history. In the fourth book, Aeneas journeys to the underworld, where he meets his father, Anchises, and learns about his destiny and the future of his people. Anchises shows Aeneas a vision of the future, including the founding of Rome and the rise of Augustus, the first Roman emperor. In the fifth book, Aeneas arrives in Italy and meets with Latinus, the king of the Latins, who welcomes him and promises him the hand of his daughter, Lavinia, in marriage. However, Latinus' wife, Amata, is opposed to the match and stirs up a rebellion against Aeneas. In the sixth book, Aeneas travels to the underworld again, this time to consult with the Sibyl, a priestess who foretells the future. Aeneas sees the souls of the dead and learns about the future of Rome and the fate of his own descendants. In the seventh book, Aeneas allies himself with the Etruscan king, Mezentius, and fights against Turnus, the leader of the Rutulians, who are also seeking Lavinia's hand in marriage. The battle is fierce and many heroes on both sides are killed, including Pallas, a young warrior who was Aeneas' ally and friend. In the eighth book, Aeneas allies himself with the Italian river god, Tiberinus, and receives a divine shield from Vulcan, the Roman god of fire. Aeneas and his troops prepare for the final battle against Turnus and his army. In the ninth book, the battle between Aeneas and Turnus reaches its climax. The two leaders engage in single combat, and Aeneas emerges victorious, killing Turnus and securing his place as the founder of Rome. In the tenth book, Aeneas mourns the loss of Pallas and holds the funeral games in his honor. The games include chariot racing, boxing, wrestling, and other contests, and are a display of Aeneas' commitment to honoring his fallen friend. In the eleventh book, Aeneas fights against the Italian tribes who continue to resist his rule. He defeats several enemies, including the warrior Princess Camilla, and establishes his dominance over the region. In the twelfth and final book, Aeneas receives a divine. Throughout the poem, Virgil explores themes such as fate, destiny, piety, and duty. Aeneas is depicted as a heroic figure who is devoted to his people and his gods. He faces many challenges and struggles, but he never loses sight of his goal and remains committed to fulfilling his destiny. The poem also contains many references to the gods and their influence on human affairs, highlighting the importance of religion and piety in ancient Roman culture. The Aeneid has had a profound influence on Western literature and culture, inspiring writers such as Dante, Milton, and Shakespeare. Its themes of heroism, destiny, and the role of the divine in human affairs have resonated with readers for centuries. The poem is also significant for its portrayal of the founding of Rome, which became a powerful symbol of Roman identity and nationalism. In summary, the Aeneid is a masterpiece of ancient Roman literature that tells the story of Aeneas, a heroic figure who overcomes many obstacles to fulfill his destiny and establish the Roman Empire. The poem explores themes such as fate, duty, and religion, and has had a significant impact on Western culture and literature. We hope you are enjoying the content on the Library Channel. Our team is dedicated to bringing you the best book summary, recommendations, and literary discussions on YouTube. If you are finding our content helpful, 
we would greatly appreciate it if you could take a moment to like this video, leave a comment with your thoughts or suggestions, and subscribe to our channel. This will help us grow and continue to provide you with more great content in the future. Thank you for your support and happy reading.